Pokemon stories can be really great, from the games, anime, and manga, but what about another medium? This Meowth is absolutely delighted to find a nice juicy berry to sink his teeth into, but this may have been a case of wrong place, wrong time, because a nearby Inke swoops in, takes the berry, and leaves Meowth covered in ink. This is just going for a swim, as fish do, but if we look back there for a second, BOOM! Cramorant's lunch. These Natsu are having a hard time facing the cold. Snuggling up to each other just isn't enough. But later on we see that a friendly Bouffalant came along and saved them. A lot of these story-based cards show Pokemon aging alongside their trainers, and when I say a lot, I do mean a lot. There's a boy and his Charmander, a family and their Tepig, and a Ralts sticking by its trainers. Going into more intense territory, we get to see Charizard fighting Mewtwo from both perspectives. Now the zenith of Pokemon card stories is this. Trubbish sits sad and alone on a trash island, but then suddenly, Fiona appears and invites Trubbish on the adventure of a lifetime. We then see Trubbish, Empoleon, and Fiona surfing along, living their lives to their fullest. This might even be a better story than Black and White. 